Hi guys and welcome back to Agricultural Simulator Historical Farming with me, Taffin Exile. Last time out we, uh, what do we do? We ploughed our first field uh, and we put the plough back in the barn. So um, next up we have the cultivating. So let's uh, let's get ourselves a cultivator. So cultivator, and we've got two choices again. Cultivator small, not as good as the medium cultivator. Um, but it does the job. Okay, and medium cultivator. Cultivator medium. Okay, so that's a uh, spiky. Spiky. What is that? Wow, look, that's some sort of um, torture device on uh, spinny wheels, which is quite nice. And what's cultivator one is just a couple of spikes in the ground. Um, so, cultivator one is 175, cultivator two is 250. I think we need the mean torture chamber thing don't we so yep let's get that and that's over there so let's go and pick her up This is the front, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Uh, come on, this track is a bit sluggish today. So we got a triangle thing to triangle thing. Okay, she's on. How much cash have we got left? Uh, we got 17.20. Okay. Um, okay. That's not a lot, but uh, we need a muck spreader. We've got a trailer, we need a harvester. Uh, uh, it's probably not too bad, is it? We've we got, we got, we got, no, we got enough, I think. And then when we make the harvest, we can uh, get a bit more cash. I hope it's just the load, no, the load distance, because that looks absolutely crap from here, but um, I thought it was a lot better than that. Oh, that's better, yeah. Okay, so... <clears throat> Excuse me. Cultivating! Let's uh, go over the sides to make it nice, smooth transition on the way in. What we got? We got hydraulics down. So, I just, just forward. Yeah, can we go a little faster? Than, go to two speed. Oh, yeah, there, look at that. Look at that, bad boy. Go. Yeah! I might look to see how we get the detailed because that's quite look, the actual load circle as it were. It's very narrow, isn't it? It's a bit cack. Um, oh, it's not spinning round. Oh, it is. It's intermittently spinning round. Yeah. That's sort of some. Oh, we're not paying attention. And we've completely gone off track. Right down, forward. Right, let me pause the video there. Oh, lights, no. Let me pause the video there to see if I can uh, increase the uh, the graphical load jaw distance, because that's really quite pathetic that we got about a two meter spread so uh, I'll be right back okay I'm back uh, no I haven't managed to do that so um, I'll have a, I'll have a read on the uh, the forums to see how we do that because um, yeah that's quite rubbish isn't it really it's a lot of grass coming through again which I was kind of hoping wouldn't be but um, yeah, not to worry. I'll uh, figure something out. So, what's been happening? Um, so, what I did watch the Grand Prix, the British Grand Prix yesterday. Um, 
very interesting. Uh, cars going off the track all over the place with tyres exploding and delaminating and uh, causing all sorts of chaos really. Um, which is quite exciting. Uh, well done to uh, Rosberg and the Mercedes for winning uh, and uh, I thought Webb was going to get him at the end but uh, not to be, not to be. Uh, bit of a lousy one for the British drivers to be honest. I know um, Lewis got back to fourth and uh, the rest has scored well but um, yeah it's hoping for a little bit better to be honest but uh, never mind, never mind. Uh, we do seem to be cultivating this and bringing more grass into the equation which is a little bit odd I'm not sure why that's happening but it is I thought this was reasonably straightforward but now look it's kind of oh I don't know what's going on what's going on Hmm. Oh well. Not to worry, not to worry. I've been having a, a read on a lot of the forums regarding um, Agricultural Simulator 2013. Uh, I was worried that the UGI links on the page were all down, so I thought, oh, it could spell disaster. But the actual, if you go to the Agra, A G R A R. Uh, Dash Simulator um, forum that they're all actively with the developers speak talking on there, so it looks like UGI might be just sorting out their web web page, which is good news. Um, I have got the deluxe edition of the 2013 Agri Sim, um, but it doesn't have the extra perks which you get in the gold version, which has just come out on Steam, which is like the greenhouses where you can buy uh, you grow the the carrots, the veg, and all, you know, and all that that malarkey, um, and sell it at market. So we haven't got that, unfortunately. But they have mentioned that it, there may be a separate download for just the gold editions to, for you know the users who've got the uh, deluxe and the um, standard packs. Because it seems a bit it seems a bit unfair if uh, they're not going to allow us who yeah who bought the game prior to their gold edition to have access to the gold perks, you know. If they charge a small fee for it, then that's fine. You know, if it if it's too expensive, then you can buy the whole gold um, game on Steam for fourteen ninety nine. So you know, it's going to be relatively. It's going to be probably about five or or there or thereabouts. So to get a greenhouses and a few bits more of equipment, then I think that'll be well worth it. Why is our field going green? This is not right. If you know where my field is going green, please let me know. I'm thinking it's a bug, or it's probably that we're just going back down to the original grass texture, which is why it's, we're now clearing up as green. That's not good. It's not good. Yeah. See that's that's not a bad texture. Oh look. I haven't been paying attention again. I don't know, who would employ me to be a farmer? Hang on. Right, forward. Ah, so what else has been going on? Um it was a lovely sunny day in Nor uh, in um, in uh, the UK yesterday, I—I uh, I was going to say Northampton, which was where the Grand Prix was, but um, the yeah, the weather was lovely. Uh, I didn't manage to get on my motorbike. Uh, I thought about it, but um, in the end, uh, yeah, I got invited over my parents for uh, a roast dinner, so uh, I did that instead. Uh, and then I was so full after the roast dinner that I didn't fancy going out for a ride, so. I was a bit lady, lazy uh, and watched a bit of sport, more sport on telly and um, 
yeah, I didn't get around to doing very much. But there we go, that's that's what Sundays are for, aren't they? So, happy days. Got a big dip in the field there, there's like a big old triangular side has been cut through and uh, removed a big chunk of our field. But, um, oh, this looks ridiculous. Uh, can we use... Ah, we can use console commands. Okay, excellent. I'll just need to figure out which console command uh, increases the uh, draw distance and then um, I'll, I'll sort that off. Uh, sort that out off screen, I think, and then we'll have more than this little severe of about two meters, which we can uh, look at the textures. You know, because Angry 13, we've got a much bigger um, detail circle, as it were, draw distance. Um, but so let's have a look in the uh, in the options. I can see it, so um, I'll uh, I'll need to have a look further at off screen on that one. So yeah, I've been been at work today. Um, God, that was uh, I've just had a week off and just gone back for my first day. Oh my God, that was a struggle. Um, but managed to get through it, and I was on it. it went in early, so I could leave early, and uh, got home to watch the tennis as well with the old uh, Wimbledon going on. So that was good. Just just watched Murray win. Let's go through to the quarters. Uh, unfortunately, our uh, Laura Robson got knocked out, which is a shame because um, she's quite cute and uh, she's a great tennis player. So uh, you know, win-win situation when you get to watch her at Wimbledon. So that's a shame. I'm cultivating a way. La, 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 la. It's quite lonely being a farmer, isn't it? We really should train the dog. Oh, he's got nowhere to sit. I was going to say we could sit in the tractor, but no, he really can't. But the good news is, it's taken us half the time to cultivate it than it has to plough it, so uh, yeah, we're well away. I think it's going to be the same plan as in my Agri Sim. Um, I keep calling it Agri Sim, Agricultural Simulator, um, to give you its proper title, 2013 uh, Let's Play. Uh, we'll plant wheat in the field and we'll use the corn for for animal feed. I think wheat's worth more anyway, so um, yeah. There we go. I think this row, and then one one further row on the one, row, one further um, pass on the way back, and that should sort us out, I think. And happy days. We are all. Oh, hang on, that's a bit wider down here. Yeah, this field's not symmetrical. All, all my driving's all over the shop. It's probably a little from column A, a little from column B, if I'm honest. So. Uh, Do, 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 do. Right, let's just smooth this little edge bit here. Big old rut there. Yeah, up. Up she comes. Ooh, corner's quick. Right, let's uh, drop you down. I was, uh, as I say, I've been reading the forums, um, just for about hints and tips, you know, the good little things that people have uh, discovered and and uh, like to share. Uh, one of the things is the um, 
the gravity fed trailer. You know, obviously you can, you can use it to collect uh, seed from from the combine once you've done the harvest. Uh, you can obviously then dump it or sell it from that trailer uh, into a silo or sell it at the uh, the farms. But you can also um, bag it up with those trailers into uh, obviously, obviously the bags we use for seeding and uh, no, I don't know why I've got lights on. Um, or, or use for animal feed. So that that's pretty handy. I didn't know that. Uh, so I wondered how you did that. So yeah, it's with the gravity-fed trailers. So we should get just ourselves one of those. A lot of the places are actually recommending that we we money two. Uh, one basically you put all the grain in there and use them as storage. So one you use for um, the seeder when you come to reseed the farm. Uh, <laughs> reseed the farm. Reseed the field, and the other one you use for bagging for um, uh, uh, animal feed. Um, although there was an update on that one to say that was prior a patch which came out when you were limited to I think it was 35 bags of wheat or corn um, in the in the. I'm struggling with my words tonight, aren't I? Uh, in the uh, in the cellar, so. I think that's now been uh, up to about 100 and something bags, so I don't think it's the issue it once was. So uh, I don't think we'll need to get two, but we'll definitely get one because that sounds like a, a very little handy trailer to use. Let's drop you down and go forward. Let's tidy up the edge. And there we are, cultivated. It looks greener now than it did. Um, but there. Excellente! So, that didn't take half the time I thought it would. Brilliant. It looks bloody awful, but uh, look at that. Oh dear, oh dear. The graphical draw distance is a rubbish. It's a rubbish, I tell you all. Look at that. Look at that. This looks like some sort of blotch on the landscape. Anyway, that is our neatly cultivated field, which will work wonders for us. Um, Let's put this away nice and neatly in the barn. It's not as sunny as it was earlier, my oh dear. Oh good, that deer's left. Uh, no, I didn't want to do that. I'm doing everything wrong tonight. Why am I doing everything wrong? Here we go, that's what I'm doing. So we'll pop this next to our plow. Oh look, since we've driven in here, our tractor's been cleaned. Awesome, is this an automatic, we've got an automatic car wash as we come in the barn. Wow, that's pretty cool. Oh wow, I wish I had one of those at home. We've got a spanky shiny new tractor now, look at that, woohoo! Oh yeah, a little, little wheelie on the way out. Excellent, well, let's just close the barn door. There we go. So, oh the sun's coming out again, lovely. So, field has been cultivated, hooray! Next time, uh, look into seed. Oh, let's just, oh no, the, the, no I was going to check the, um, the corn, but uh, I think we've got tons of corn anyway. Uh, not corn, wheat, sorry. So yeah, there we go. Um, let's leave it there. Uh, everything's been... If I move that tractor jiggles. Anyway, it's another glitch we don't want to look at. Uh, let's look over here. Lovely church. Yeah, so as I said, um, field's been cultivated. Next time out we'll uh, look to seed and um, fertilise with the manure. So yeah, thanks for, thanks for watching and uh, see you then.